hello guys so today I'm gonna show you some new features of Wisetalk uh, which are AI generated comments on TikTok and analyzing the transcript data of any TikTok video so what this basically means is if you want to send an AI generated comment or uh, a really good comment on your beh behalf uh, for you to engage and uh, attract more leads or customers for your business or your uh, page in general uh, this tool will really help you achieve that it will create multiple AI generated comments that are extremely relevant and are able to uh, you're able to prompt properly to mirror your uh, mirror your wants so let's get started so to start you need to go on TikTok first so just go on TikTok uh, by the way if you didn't know the after you install Wisetalk the app will be listening to any data you want in the background as you can see it's collecting data so we don't want to collect data just yet so let's just switch off uh, data collection for posts uh, let's reload this to remove the collected co and now we disable the data collection for posts so now let's search let's say you're selling digital uh, digital marketing courses so let's search for digital marketing and let's find a really good uh, post really quality post all right this seems like a cool account all right this is a good account so now we go back and let's re-enable uh, collection for posts and we want to collect all the data for this account so when we go to this account the app will start collecting data from the posts so let's wait for it to load As you can see it's loaded so the app is collecting the data of this page this TikTok page in the background just have to scroll all the work is being done by the app all right we collected some posts now let's go back to the app you can see it was collecting data and uh, as you can see it collected data from 137 items which means posts so now we have all this data populated uh, for this account about digital marketing and the main these are all the stats for each posts these are really relevant information to tell us about the posts and uh, if we want to arrange or filter out posts we don't need we can use all this data so for example here there is the video links in seconds so we if we want to find longer videos we can just click here and this is the longest from all this 137 posts uh, so these are all the data including the video sound and all other important data so now I'm gonna show you here as you can see there is video transcripts so when you click load transcript it will load everything that was said inside that that video inside that TikTok video 
so you have all this uh, everything that's being said and this is really important because it, this will give our AI context so now let's go back and we need to apply filter so let's create a new filter in order to find a good post to engage on uh, we need to apply some filters here so let's say uh, quality posts for commenting all right this is a good name for our filter you can name it whatever you want and for the filters to apply you can go uh, here and you can choose from any of these filters these are all filters that you could apply so it can be extremely customized for your needs and uh, there is a detailed uh, documentation about this if you want but we need only few filters from this to achieve our task so let's go back to our um, filter section then we need these three filters to find a really good match so let's just copy these three filters and I'll explain them one by one so this filter uh, checks if the video has transcript and uh, if the video have transcript it will show so if uh, the video doesn't have any transcripts it will hide it and uh, here the video lengths between 60 seconds and then almost 10,000 seconds this basically means we don't want shorter videos or videos less than 60 seconds and the third filter is comments comments between 100 and 900,000 basically we need posts with more than 100 comments so all these uh, criteria have to be true uh, have to match uh, for the post to be shown to us so let's save this filter as you can see we successfully added the filter to the quick filter panel so we we find our quality posts for commenting the, the filter we just created so when we click here the number of items should be reduced only five items match our criteria we saved a lot of time that means now we can go to our transcripts as you can see these are the transcripts so we can auto load all transcripts if you don't want to click on a every button uh, for each video so let's auto load we basically have five transcripts so <coughs> so basically we loaded every transcript you can auto load transcripts for the whole profile of a page so this is a really powerful tool for example you can just start auto loading transcripts after you loaded like 800 posts or videos by an, a page and it will auto load all the transcripts and you can use that data anytime you want by exporting it as a csv you could download it as a csv or you can send a webhook for example to make.com to create workflows that are really complex and meets your needs so you can use all this data in different ways but today i'm going to show you one way you can use this data so let's just sort this this uh, this post by the number of uh, comments or the links or less sorted by the links for the so that the app 
will get more context. So the where is video links? Uh, as you can see, you can just click here in the video links header and it will sort by video links. So this is the longest video, the first one. So let's just go back here and let's copy the prompt for chat GPT. After this, let's just go to chatgpt.com. And we just need to paste the, the prompt. It was already copied. You just need to paste it, then click send. It should be able to tell you it has analyzed all the transcript data. Uh, I'm ready to receive instructions on how to analyze the subtitle data from the TikTok video. Nice. So after we done this, now we need to uh, let's close this for now. Let's go here and let's open the post link. Now we don't need to collect any post data, so let's just disable this. And we need to collect data, uh, the comments, so we'll en enable that. All right, so now let's open the post that we copied for the transcript. Let's click here. As you can see, now it's these are the comments. You just have to scroll the comments. Don't need to do anything else. Scroll the comments. scrolled the comments available now you just go back to our app and in the comments scanned comments as you can see we have 125 comments collected nice so these are the comments collected including the comments so here we also have filters if you want to filter out comments you want for example comments with a question mark you can just use different filters uh, here you can use comment filters here that are available let's we need to copy for example let's copy this uh, filter and let's go back to our comments scanned comments and let's create a new filter all right Let's paste, oh, this is the name of the filter. Let's say more than 10 words. This will be the name of the filter and the filter will be word count between 10 and let's say 999. But the max is 150, all right, so this basically means the the comments with words less than 10 words will be skipped or ignored and only it will only show us comments with more than 10 words this is useful because uh, for the AI it's better to give uh, uh, good context and more words means more context so it, it can generate a really good reply so let's save the filter. As you can see, it's successfully saved. Now we can find our filter here. And let's just apply the filter. So we have 36 comments. And we applied the filter. All right, now let's sort by comment word count. So let's click the header. So as you can see, the minimum is 10 and uh, the maximum 
the biggest comment we found is this with 36 words now we just have to copy the CSV data let's copy it here let's go above and this is a custom prompt uh, this is just for you to access your prompt anytime and paste it you can also save it in a word document it doesn't matter so this is the, the best uh, prompt to we generated but you can customize this as you want and test out different prompts so we're gonna paste the CSV data here all right we pasted the CSV data then we're gonna copy the whole prompt and we're gonna go back to chat GPT and we're gonna paste the prompt perfect now let's click send now what it's basically doing is it's generating uh, code for the app to read and uh, insert to TikTok. so it's gonna read the original comment and generate a reply for each comment it's gonna first what we did is uh, read the transcript so we fed chat gpt the whole transcript of the video so it knows what the video is about and we also gave it each comment so based on the video transcript it's giving generating new replies so the replies it generates are really high quality it's not like some other AI uh, bad AI generated comments that can be spotted easily this is really good for engagement and also it answers questions based on the transcript data so basically it's like you watch the video the whole video and answering the, the questions based on the video and this added with all the data chat GPT has this is a really powerful way to engage with people and people like that you answer their questions directly and uh, this will generate you a lot of leads for your business so you can continue for example this is the first phase we can just type out continue And it's gonna continue the next batch of comments and uh, this is uh, basically uh, it's using all this transcript data from the video and uh, it's replying based on that data so all this replies you generated in less than two minutes which would probably take you a lot of hours and a lot of brain power to come up with all this replies but here it's done in just under a minute or two minutes you can also e edit this re replies uh, if you see that you need to edit the replies so let's test out the collection so we just need to go back to TikTok and uh, to our TikTok page and as you can see now the comments are highlighted this highlighted comments basically have a an AI reply access so those ones who are highlighted have a AI response from that uh, chat GPT so for example let's say you want to reply to this account so you could write your own reply for example you can read and say I'm here to help this basically needs a lot of time and brain power 
so the best solution we c came up with together with wise talk is you just have to uh, type one for the first part of the AI generated comments so type the number one and it will insert the AI generated response for this comment so it says please help so after you put your template how do you enter how do I enter my download and my word document in the ebook the information I already typed up no one is going over this part please assist based on this it's generated a response after selecting your template go to upload and to add your word document content into the ebook customize it as needed check my page for more so what we basically did here is we didn't even watch the video understand the video but we are replying like we saw the whole video and we know what we're talking about and we're saving time so this is a really powerful tool so you can just type this and you can just post and other people also uh, seeing this comment reading comments are going to come to your page and check out your business and see that you're being helpful so this is really good for your business to attract uh, eyeballs and to attract leads for your business let's go to another one let's come here and let's reply to this let's add one so as you can see here it's replied does it stand store promote your products or do you have to put it purely yourself you'll need to promote your products yourself but stand store makes it easy to set up and manage yourselves visit my page for more marketing tips so you could this is a really powerful tool so you can do this for any niche you want we generally pick digital marketing but you could do it for any to any topic you could create multiple accounts uh, for example you, you might be limited on the number of comments you can do per day for a single account but with this tool you can create multiple TikTok accounts and go on different uh, TikTok videos and reply really uh, personalized and useful uh, replies to people's questions or comments and build engagement and grow your following grow your brand awareness so I'm pretty sure you already see the value in this app so basically you just need to go on google and search for wise talk and it, this app also has other different features like hashtags you can discover hashtags for example you could go to all these hashtags and uh, find tiktok videos to comment on and uh, discover new videos new eyeballs new people and uh, you could also uh, you could also track when you go live on uh, TikTok. When you go live on TikTok, or you can do different other stuff. And you could also scan uh, for search terms, and uh, re you could also collect comments on uh, live pro broadcasts to engage with people so thank you very much for uh, checking out wise talk